Hello everyone, I welcome you all to Geeky Script. Today I am going to show you how to get user input from console and how to use those values on your program. So we are going to demonstrate in on a C++ programming, so process will be same for C program as well. So in my previous videos I have showed you how to set up Visual Studio code for C and C++ programming. So there I have showed you how to install this plugin called extension pack, then code runner. Also I have showed you how to install MinGW compiler. So all the steps are already done on my previous video. So if you haven't set up Visual Studio code for C++ programming, then I highly recommend you to watch my previous videos. So once you are done with that, it's time to get user input. So for that, let's go to this explorer and create a new file and let's name this file as user input dot cpp for c++ programming hit enter so that will open this user input dot cpp file over here so let's quickly write a user input program and here is our program so we are first defining three variables called first number second number and sum and then we are asking user to provide those two integers so with our c out we are asking that to user and when we get that to values we, we are just capturing that within first number and second number using c in and then we are using this logic to add these two numbers so first number plus second number and we are getting that final output on our variable sum and that is what we are printing over here so we are, this is how we are going to show so first number so whatever user is typing so that number plus this this plus is a string variable and then we are getting that second number so whatever user is typing so that first number plus second number equal to that summation of these two number what we are getting over here will actually get printed all right and finally we are returning zero because it is a int main method so it expects something integer to be returned all right so you know just simply write this much go to file and save this file and let's go to terminal and click on new terminal so here on our new terminal we are going to switch to just simply click on that we are going to switch to command prompt so just click on that so our command prompt will be rightly opened over here so let's compile our program user input.c++ so just simply type g++ and then you to provide your file name which is user input.c++ so user input.cpp hit enter so immediately we will see that our file is rightly compiled with no errors and it will generate a file called a.exe so to execute that file so just simply type over here and hit a and hit enter so immediately we'll see that it is asking for enter to integer right so you need to provide those two number so let's uh, type it one by one so let's give a uh, integer called six hit enter so first number is captured now it's time to provide next number so let's give 8 as a next number hit enter and there you go and now you get that output right so user typed 6 and 8 so summation of these two numbers 6 plus 8 14 is actually showing on our console right so in this way you get user input on console and use those user input values on your program so that is basically all about this video. Don't forget to subscribe your channel Geeky Script along with Geeky Syntax. So here also regularly I post a lot of coding related videos. So if you are subscribing this, that's going to really motivate me to make more similar kind of videos. And lastly, special thanks to the supporters of our channel. We are truly grateful to you guys. Supports like this really motivate us to create and improving these videos. Again, thanks a lot for being an essential part of our journey. And also I am posting a lot of videos on WordPress so I highly recommend you to watch all these different videos. So if you are watching this video then that is going to really help you to learn more about WordPress. So that is basically all about this video friends. Thank you very much for watching this video and God bless you all.